Lissy. I'm Carlos Rodriguez. And we're going to teach you how Magneto is tied. Magneto! Make sure to observe all safety precautions. Safety glasses on. Keys on the dash. It is also very important to make sure you have the proper technical documentation. Am I on? Today, we will be timing the Slick 4200 series Magneto on our 1971 Cessna 150. <laughs> Magneto must be installed with its timing marks correctly aligned and with the number one cylinder on compression stroke and the number one piston in advanced firing position. Oh, uh, how do we know that the number one cylinder uh, on a compression stroke and number one piston is on the advanced firing position? Remove the lower spark plugs from two, three, and four cylinders and remove the upper spark plug from cylinder one. very important to use a proper spark plug holder. Place one thumb on the hole of the number one cylinder and rotate the crankshaft in normal direction until positive pressure is felt through the cylinder. find the advanced firing position. What is the, the advanced firing position? It's funny you should ask. The advanced firing position can be found by rotating the propeller in the opposite direction of rotation, approximately 30 degrees, and then back until you align or come close to aligning your timing marks which can be found here. To time a magneto, you must hook up the push box. Make sure the red lead is to the left. Make sure green lead is to the other one, which is right. Most important, make sure you get this on the ground. Hold on there, Carlos. Not the ground. We're hooking up to airframe ground. Ah. All set. Make sure you have the magnetos in both position when timing them together. The next step in timing a magneto is to turn on your buzz box and bump the propeller. 
to see which magneto is firing incorrectly. As we can see, the left magneto is firing correctly as checked by our timing marks. Now we have to bump the right magneto until it lines up. If your magneto timing is off, you'll have to bump the magneto to bring it into correct timing position. To bump the mags, loosen the mounting nuts until the magneto moves freely. Then, using the palm of your hand, bump the mag into correct timing position. To check magneto timing, bump the propeller in direction of rotation and observe the indication on the buzz box. As always, be mindful of the prop arc. As you can see, the indication lights are within a bump of each other. This magneto is now timed. <laughs> Finally, we finish up by reinstalling the spark plugs and leads. And of course, no maintenance job is complete until the paperwork is done and signed off. And finally, return the aircraft to its owner. Bloopers! Si miras a este anigón, si mira con esto, necesitamos tunear con el rojo, con la esquedria y con el verde en la vieja. Necesitamos el magnito. Put your eye right there. Grab his butt. <laughs> I'm stuck. Huh. How do we know that the number one cylinder crashed out? <laughs> <laughs> I totally messed that up. I can't get it. Alright, alright, alright. Is that awkward enough?